Turning and Turning by John Siegel. My heart is a ceaseless polemic against my mind, a vitriolic seesaw of harangue and rhyme. My personality is a fight club, dream versus reality, title bout winner, convoluted mentality. There's an actor lying in every one of us, a warden within each of our chests. Yet the prisons in perpetually going out west in search of social congress as if loneliness with just another sexual conquest. I must confess there's never been a co-pilot or a parachute just perception, an amalgamation of belief and outright refusal. Your soul's the canvas, God ain't nothing but an easel. Whether combatant fists or resolute handshake, we're just passing roaches in an apocalyptic clam bake. Our collective hands inhumanly conjoined in matrimonial massacre, our societal ring finger marred by injurious prurient predilections, religiously hijacked elections, global thermonuclear moral digressions, and lack of any true spiritual direction. A tourniquet placed upon our history, amputation imminent, None of us fully into it. I into it through the mind of legless Inuit. I used to hang wit outside the tunnel top. His name was Ray, not Robert Paulson. He had the pulse of what was going on on Bush Street back in the day. I'd roll a cigarette and become audience to audible eloquence. No handicap to his elegance, no handout to rebel against. I simply listen to his verbal smiles, existential pillow talk, two lovers frequently flying philosophical miles. I'd shake his hand, then go back to my fear and whiskey. I mean, beer and whiskey. Seems clear as day. See that I've had too much of all of this political song and dance shit. Ain't nothing evangelical or lyrical about it. Just another complaining, overeducated, privileged voice. Rap mem ick. Can I get a witness? But what's the litmus test on authenticity? When beautifully packaged empty fodder wins the Grammy. When predictable formulaic literary gymnastics wins the slam, see? Put here to fight for fame and glory. Never meant to be a gemstone or precious metal story. And if you look around, reality is not just getting, but it's been pretty gory. Edward Snowden pulls the plug on U.S. snooping tactics, and you still caught up on bi-monthly payday mathematics. I know six-year-old Girl Scouts with bigger balls than you, son. Trump that. And you have the nerve to pull that tired AR-15 card on my kingdom? Fuck that. Your ass backwards at a donkey show, and the government's dick keeps asking for seconds. Too busy on the floor begging for repentance, when there ain't no saving you from this next sentence. Go get a life, you conservative fuckhead, and leave mine alone. See, most of us still got a dream. 
And this flag-waving, nationalistic, misogynistic, ballistic-toting, torch-carrying, adolescent windbag, white pride, craps, gotta go. And I know this may be a low blow, but all y'all's holy books are wrong. Time to grow up and start singing a new song. Peace on earth ain't sitting on a bench somewhere waiting for the right time to come home. It takes work, real honest with one's self work. And I know you may not be ready to hear this, but I love you regardless. And in the end, your hate may still kill me, but I've been down that road before and you all still don't know me.